Hey, welcome back. The figure shows a circle with a radius of five units and a center O. We have two quantities and we want to compare their quantities to see if one's greater than the other, they're equal, or if we just can't determine the relationship with the information given. The answer here is quantity B is greater. And here's why. So quantity B is simply three pi, and so there's nothing for us to do there. Quantity A is the area of sector AOB. So that's a little more complicated, but we can get there just the same. So notice the circle here. In this circle, I want you to see that the sector AOB is this section right here. That's the section we're discussing. And so we want to find its area. So I'll simply highlight it here and say that, hey, look, we need the area of that slice of pizza. So now that I'm hungry, we're going to move forward <laughs> and find the area of that sector. And here's how we do it. We're dealing with a circle. And so the area of a circle is equal to pi r squared, where r is the radius. Now, we have 30 degrees here. All right, so if you can't see it, that's 30 degrees. And the thing is, that's the portion of the circle that we have. Remember, the total angle measure in a circle is 360 degrees. So we have 30 out of 360 of the area of the circle. So with that said, what we need to do here is multiply 30 out of 360 by that area. And just to simplify now, you can simplify 30 out of 360 into 1 over 12. And we're going to multiply that by the area of the circle. So what's the area of the circle? Well, the radius is 5, so we're good to go. The area of the circle will be pi times 5 squared, or 25 pi. So again, that's the area of the circle, and what we said that we would do is take that sector, so that 30 out of 360, multiply it by the area of our circle to get our complete answer. So this will be 25 pi divided by 12. So which is greater, 25 pi over 12 or 3 pi? Well, we can just ignore the pi's because there's a pi in each. So we're really just comparing 25 over 12 with 3 pi, or just 3. So which one's bigger? Well, you can grab your calculator, and 25 divided by 12 is about 2.08 something. And 3 is still 3. So 3 is bigger. And because 3 is bigger, quantity B is bigger. And that's why it's the answer. So I hope that made sense initially and throughout the problem. And if it doesn't, check out the written solution. And if that doesn't make sense either, just reach out to us. We're more than happy to help.